What is going on, everybody? It is the Beast 93 here with you, aka Yellowhammer Gaming, and we are on Construction Simulator 2. Uh, it just released on consoles yesterday, I believe. Uh, it's an awesome game. I love it. Uh, of course, I mean, I work construction in real life. I run heavy equipment, so it's kind of a kind of a thing for me. But <clears throat> I'm gonna have y'all on today for one job, just to see how you guys like it. See if you might want some more. Uh, see if you guys might want to see some more of it. Um, excuse me, just a second. Okay, sorry about that. I'm gonna run off the road. And I do have the traffic turned off for this, but I do have um, traffic violations on. So, I, you know, if I run a red light or or uh, something like that, then I will probably get a ticket for it. But yeah, it ought to be a pretty interesting experience for you guys. Uh, might be seeing a lot more of this on YouTube here in the next coming weeks. Uh, I mean, it's it's the same game from the mobile version, but it's been you know modified for consoles. Uh, they didn't add anything that I can see or change anything or anything like that they just uh they just put it over on consoles but we let's see let's go to the menu here let's go look at our job this is the job we're doing now it's a two-story residential house we do it the total payout will be ninety five thousand dollars you get paid for every task you complete like I just brought my little back co over a few minutes ago before I started recording and dug the foundation and I got thirteen thirteen thousand for that so I'll pour the concrete and I'll get paid for that and so on and so forth it's it's a pretty big job uh, honestly I'm actually uh, renting this this truck right now because I don't you know I don't have enough money to to buy it. But what we got to do here is mm, pretty simple. Pull up a little bit. The controls ain't too bad on it, but I mean it. It can get uh, kind of tedious. Let's try that and see what that's at. Oh, no, way too far. I'll pull up a little bit. See what you got to do is you got two different camera views. If you pull up here. Um, what you have to do is you have to, in order to be able to look around like this, you have to, pre you know, you have to press it one time and then whenever you get to your work position, you press it again and see, I can't move around right here. And that moves your, uh, your functions and stuff, either your, uh, your boom or, uh, shoots on the concrete truck or your crane or whatever not very easy to get lined up here with this Let me go 
back into the settings and change that. Thought it might work a little bit better that way, but apparently not. Um, and here in your settings, you can change your high hydraulic controls on your excavators and stuff from SAE Euro or ISO. I recommend S SAE Euro because you can use your joysticks. If you've ever seen been in a piece of equipment, it's just like that. It works great. Um, I tried the ISO. The ISO is pretty much backwards to to this right here. So everything is backwards. But what I was doing here. Release. All right, let's try that. I might be a little better there. There we go. That should be good. Now I'll press R again, and I c now I can just move <coughs> move my shoots, and I'll press Square. And we are. Let's see. I'm just gonna move it over. And basically, what you gotta do is. Just watch it until it fills up, and then you know just keep steadily moving your your concrete over. And you watch up here in the right corner, right there beside my character. You'll see that bar going up, and when you get that bar filled up, then that means the task is complete. Now see I can't put no more concrete right here so what I'm going to have to do is stop it and I'm going to have to move. On the, I want to say the, okay it's all on this side so I need to go back down the side here. On the mobile version, you know, once you get on up in levels, there's five levels you max out on. I'm just going to be on level two. Uh, and once you do that, once you get to level five, then all the vehicles and stuff is unlocked. If I can add an extension. Nope. Alright, we gotta get closer. I'm gonna do it on my backup, get right about there. We'll start running the concrete. Whoop. Wasting concrete. Oh, once you get it in the right spot, it'll start moving. See that up there is moving up pretty quick. So, I mean, it's hit. <coughs> Alright, now it's done. Alright, the bars didn't stop moving, so we hit that. Hit square, we'll stop it again. And we'll basically, we'll just move up a little bit. Right here in the clear spot. And then we'll start again. Whoa. I have to move it a little bit to get in. Make sure it's covering the rebar. It might be kind of a long video because I want you guys to really be able to see. Okay, we gotta stop it there. Now we'll go to this side over here. It won't take just a little bit, <coughs> a little bit now, and it'll be done. On a big construction site, I mean a little 
foundation like this, you know, it wouldn't, uh, it wouldn't take much at all, really, to pour the, uh, to pour this, but industrial construction, most of the time we're pouring big slabs and big foundations and you're not pouring uh, something like this, like a, uh, I don't even know the word for it, to be honest with you. Mm. Oh no, I take that back. We do do this sometimes, depending on what <clears throat> what the building is that they're pouring. Um, all right, that's done. We can confirm that. All right, now we clear the area. We'll fold our sheet back up. All right, and we just got 12 grand for that. Now we got to go get a pallet of MDF and a one and some lumber. Okay, what I'll do is I'll press down and I'll hit uh, no. Oh, I hit square and we'll, ret we'll return the vehicle because right now that I'm renting is costing me. Uh, Austin it cost me it charges you so much per minute so but it's a fun little game thank you. you might enjoy it if you give it a try it ain't but 15 bucks on the PlayStation store like I said, if you've ever played the mobile version, it's just like that. I mean, they didn't add anything extra. It's it's not uh, all the vehicles and stuffs the same, but maybe that <clears throat> I've been following them ever since they talked about bringing it out, and they said that this is their first time on consoles, trying on consoles. So maybe later on they'll. You know, add some more stuff, add some more, more to the map, because I'm just in one section right now. Let's see, if I press up here, you got three other locations. Once you do so much in one, then you can go to the other. And then right here is the supply store. But I ain't gonna sit here and blab years off. I'll swing in here and I'll get this materials. And I'll kind of speed it up a little bit. And then I'll get back with you when we get back to the site.
Alright, so we made it back to the construction site. Now we gotta unload this stuff um, in the markers over here. Let's see, I'm gonna try to get on the other side of it and see if we can get lined up. And when you're trying to, you know, unload and load this stuff up, it don't have to be perfect. I mean, you can get it perfect if you want to, but I mean, as long as you get it to where it can unload, then it can unload. strap load once you get up to where you can uh, to set a tower to uh, if you want to buy or rent a tower crane you can and when you do these jobs, it's got to, I'll show you in just a minute where you can set them up at. reset the vehicle and you could do it by yourself too if you don't want to reset it you can move it by yourself that little spot over there is where you can set your tower crane up if you got one if you own one stuff up here. I guess. Let me drive off a little bit here and see if it'll pop up. No, it didn't pop up. Go ahead here and maybe we can set this up. I might have to move this. be able to do that just yet. We do these over here. We need to do these side pieces first. Then I have to set up And you hold O. 
and R or R3 and you can rotate it to whichever way you need it. Extend it out. So you showed you how we're gonna do this, so I'm gonna turn some music on and just let you guys let you guys sit back and enjoy the show.
All right, so I'm gonna get this done, and uh, y'all kind of know what's going on. And then whenever we get to, we're almost done with this job. But when we get to the end of it, I'll be back with y'all. So y'all just hang tight.